What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another, another Legacy Cube stipulation draft, courtesy of you, you boy, Xanthor05. Uh, Salt High Frank Happiness Stip must take Ashiok, Treachery, him, if possible. Rest is up to you. Enjoy your favorite color combination and mine. I will see if I can do as much. I'm not kidding, there's beer inside my keyboard, and eh, I don't like it. <laughs> okay, that's funny. So, when I came back from the break, I actually went, blah, 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 I made like a scary noise, right? And it was spontaneous and, and louder than the music. And I was like, you know, I, I always try to get you guys, but sometimes I, I don't know if it works or not. And then, uh, nature's little treasure, otherwise known as Japoshi, said, damn it, Frank, I spilled my dang drink. And then I said, I don't know if you're kidding or not, but that's pretty funny. And then he said, I'm not kidding. There's beer inside my keyboard. Eh, I don't like this. <laughs> oh, don't they only work one per person? What does that mean? Oh, yeah, Austin, that'd be great. Let's, uh, yeah, grab me some marina codes that I'll give them out this time. I forgot to last time. Um, Yeah, that'd be cool. We'll do that. The arena codes, yeah, they're one person. They're not for me. They're to give out. Can we scare Moochel next time he comes in? Yeah, I don't know how you guys would help, but you can definitely do it. All right, we're Sultai. Sultai in. <sighs> Packrat's a card where you're like, I can just win. Sylvan Library is a card where, like, I can just win, too. Sultai, Sylvan Library is just so good. I can't tell if it's Sylvan Library or Packer right here. I think it's Sylvan Library. I want to be baser green because I want to be able to... Uh, God, Woodfall Primus and a Liliana and a, and a Hydroid Crisis. Liliana double black. Not not feeling that. Hydroid Crassus is nice. I bet Hydroid Crassus comes back. I bet we take Woodfall Primus and the Crassus comes back. Guys, you know how I feel about Woodfall Primus. God, why do I like this card so much? It's just so hard to deal with. The Persist is annoying. Killing lands is annoying. Natural Ordering it is annoying. I totally do want to take Primus. Okay. You said it. And it's green, so I'm fine with it. It's it's in it's in our colors. Ooh, two creature lands in our colors. I think Chromatic Lantern might be better, and I bet one of these comes back. Also Karn. Ooh. Maybe I just take the Karn, dude. I rarely get to play Karn in in Q. I'm taking this Karn. What if we reset some games? Uh, Solemn Simulacrum is actually nice. It ramps us to Karn and it also fixes our triple colored our triple colored nature. Also, we could just we could be Sultai and splash the red for this guy. We're gonna take Solemn Simulacrum here. Woodland Cemetery. Yeah, that's probably the best card in here. I like Hostage Taker as well, but I really do want fixing if we're gonna be three colors. Yeah, we'll take the Woodland Cemetery. Maybe the Hostage Taker comes back. Maybe the Woodland Cemetery comes back. I don't want to risk it. He's not even a three drop in the cube. What's wrong with you? My goodness. Dragon Lord Silumgar? Didn't we just mention playing this dude? And Phil, Gooden makes me feel bust? Hmm. I mean, that's, uh... Yeah, I guess that's a thing that I could do. Ooh, Toxic Deluge. Deluge makes me feel good. Yeah, I think Deluge is just OP. Just overpowered. Every time uh, the songs always get stuck in my head. Why isn't bribery in this cube? I don't know, actually. You got me. Uh, this Nissa is the only viable option in this pack, and I actually do like this Nissa a lot. I'm hoping we get uh, Tropical, Breeding Pool, Bayou, and... Overgrown Cemetery. I almost couldn't think of it. 
Mossy Beard, you haven't had a moose for a while, buddy. Where you been? Thank you. Gimpy, man, thanks so much. Hey, Ring, it's almost been, it's almost beer 30, so can't stick around. Wanted to give the thing. Thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. Enjoy your beer 30. I like all the cards we have so far. I like Sylvan Library over Packrat. I think that was a good. Uh, Underground Sea would be great. I was only mentioning the lands that Nissa could untap, though. I'll take it into the Royal. That's playable. So I want to get all those, all the forests that I can untap with Nissa. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? You feel me? Did someone say 30? <laughs> Did someone say going it's definitely beer 30 for me and that's why i'm hanging with the stream that's a good that's a solid choice juposhi as well apparently although it's now it's beer 30 for his keyboard the liliana came back guys this ain't no joke The Hissing Quagmire and a Bloodstained Mire came back? Wow. Quagmire and, and Bloodstained Mire? I think we're taking Bloodstained Mire because it's just much better in terms of, like, if we do get uh, Bayou or Underground or anything like that. Okay, nothing here, but I'm going to I'm gonna hate on this, this rampaging Ferocidon. Anguished on making, I guess. Dragon Skull Summit. If that Nicol Bolas is the last pick, then we get to we get to play it off this Dragon Skull Summit. It won't be. That's not how the packs were distributed, unfortunately. Any lands? Just heard a big ass noise. I don't know what it was. Hunter heard it too. He was like, either animate dead, or deep analysis, or rattleclaw mystic. Rattleclaw helps with the blue. It doesn't help with the black. I would really like a sultai rattleclaw mystic. Is that a thing? It might just be deep analysis. I feel like card drawing in limited in, in cube is very, very good. I also do like animate dead because it's just, I mean, if you're animating one of your own, I'm going to go with the animate dead. Thank you. Crutch Jr., welcome back. Can't believe it's been seven months. Thank you for all the amazing YouTube and like, really appreciate it, buddy. Thank you. Him to Torok. We have to take a him to Torok. That is part of the stipulation. So slide that bad boy right on in. Uh, I don't really feel bad about missing any of these other cards. So, um, Blooming Marsh is actually fine. I like it here because we have Liliana and him to Torok, so I'm okay with uh, Thank you. taking a land that lets you. I can't believe it's been seven months. Wow. Oh my god, so many seven months right now. Yeah, we'll just take Blooming Marsh. Oh, Drowned Catacomb. That's a nice one. That's a nice one. All right. We're living the dream. The Stip is literally right above you in the chat right now.
harmonize, not bad. Why is my poop green? That's a good question. That is a good question. I hadn't heard you talking about a step. I would have just assumed this is a regular Frank Cube draft. She's also masked. Wait, what does that mean? So if anyone at all says that Frank cheated me when I included the rest is up to him. I literally don't care if he picks all red cards for the rest of the draft. That's what up to him means. So no one has any rights to call him out. Nice. Appreciate it, buddy. Appreciate it. I kind of like Batter Skull here. I also like Harmonize. Hmm. I mean, we're not going to get, we're not going to get like, I think it's just Harmonize here. I was going to say, we're not going to get uh, Stoneforge Mystic for obvious reasons. I like a duplicate. We're all the mana. I feel like I feel like green is being cut pretty heavily here. We took a Karn over Chromatic Lantern, right? Dan Harmonize. Yeah, the, cre the creator of... Uh... I'm trying to think of a community meme that I could make here, but uh, I think we just take... Plow under for power level. Oh, abrupt decay. Okay. Could also take spawn of mayhem, but I don't feel like we're gonna be uh, cheating that guy into play very easily. Pack navigation, I actually kind of like. Opt, Opt is fine. Spellseeker is good. Actually, Spellseeker gets us Abrupt Decay into the Royal Hymn to Torok. That seems good. Pop, pop. That's Magnitude. That's Magnitude. Oh, I'll take Gifts Ungiven. Do you avoid taking Evolving Wilds? I actually do. I actually do. I mean, I appreciate our mana base so far. I'd like this Bloodstained Mire to get some things, but we do have four fixing lands so far, which is nice. Mana Confluence. Uh, yeah, I'm actually a Mana Confluence fan. I think it's, I think it's a decent fixing. Lingering Souls. Meh. I mean, we can just take the Fire Ice and tap a permanent. We can also just splash it off of this Dragon Skull Summit. What are these? What are these red cards doing? What are these white cards doing? Man, the Mardu is real open. <gasps> oh, we're doing it. Oh, we're doing it. <laughs> That's... What, what were the cards? The, also, the Hydroid Crassus didn't come back, I just realized. What were the cards we have to take? Ashiok, Treachery, and him. We got two out of three. That's pretty good. Oh, Apex Predator. Jiraga Tree Speaker. I thought that upheaval was a treachery for a second. We don't really have an upheaval deck, unfortunately. I think it's got to be Tree Speaker here. Our blue is definitely our lightest splash, and I feel like Green Warden or Garrick will come back. Yeah, we'll take Green Speaker. Green Speaker, Tree Speaker. Taiga does work with uh, <clears throat> with Bloodstained Mire, but I don't think we're going to take it over. Uh... Until you get Treachery, it's just stealing his money, obviously, yeah. I was thinking the same thing. I'm like, God, I'm really scamming. Terastodon, you're a little fat for us. Oh, Elves of Deep Shadow is great. Turn one Elf of Deep Shadow lets us cast Ashiok on turn two. Yeah, that's pretty much that's pretty much gas. It also still lets us cast Duress on turn two. Watery Grave is nice. That turns on our Bloodstained Mire. And I can't see anything else that I would take over that. Yeah, that's great. Oh man, we're doing it. Misty Rainforest. Woo! We also need four playables here, but I think we'll be all right. None of these other cards are exciting anyway. Wow, Misty's great for us. That gasp was cartoonish in nature. Oh, 
Oh, we're. <gasps> oh, we're. <laughs> that was a good one, though. I'm a fan of that. I'm a fan of my own gasp there. Treasure map is nice. Gilded Lotus is nice because we can ramp to any of these guys. Prismatic Lens, also fine. Murderous Cut, also fine. Doom Whisper, fine. Like, there's five cards in here that I would like to take, and I think two of them are coming back. I bet Armageddon and Spectral Possession are the ones that come back. I mean, do we really have Toxic Deluge, Liliana, uh, Abrupt Decay, Into the Royal, which is fine. Silumgar. I mean, I, we have six creatures. I think we're, I think we're more, more needing like threats. Like, I think we'll just take Doom Whisper here. Overgrown Tomb and Thief of Sanity. Oh no! Thief of Sanity is so good. So is Overgrown Tomb. I think it's Thief of Sanity. Yeah, Thief of Sanity is nice because we have Elves of Deep Shadow lets us cast it on turn two. God, I really wanted that Overgrown Tomb, but I think we're okay. We have a Watery Grave. Our mana's looking okay. We also have Blooming Marsh, Woodland Cemetery. I think we're okay. Hinter oh boy, Scarab God. I was gonna take this Hinterland Harbor, but this Scarab God is too good to pass up. That guy is a that guy's a snack, dude. Also, if any of those other lands come back, I would be more than okay with that. Whew. Hero's Downfall. That's great. All right, we're doing it. Wow, that's fantastic. Inquisition of Kozilek, I like a lot. I also don't mind Kira. Just, like, making all our guys Im impossible to kill. I like Inquisition. We'll just take Inquisition here. Wow, Mind Shatter, huh? Steam Vents actually makes our Bloodstained Mire a blue land. It's probably better than Mind Shatter, which I don't think we're going to be playing. Murmuring Mystic, are you any good here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I'm going to take the Duress. I think Duress is probably going to be better for us. We could Splash K Command, actually. It's not terrible. We also do have a Dragon Skull Summit as well. So, actually, Steam Vents gives us Bloodstain Mire. Steam Vents, Misty Rainforest, Mana Confluence, and Dragon Skull Summit. It gives us five sources of... Do we like Red Cap or do we like Bloodline Keeper here? Ooh, this is interesting. I think I like Bloodline Keeper better. All right, up to 25. I feel like the blue is just mildly splashed. <laughs> Did I say Flame Slash Venerated Locks it on? I feel like... No, I said Spectral Procession, but I'll still take a Flame Slash and splash it more like flame splash right bloodline keeper is kind of like a planeswalker actually Okay, so we need two cuts. I don't think we're cutting any of the one drops. Into the Royal's pretty meh. I actually don't love Spellseeker here. It does let us get Pact Navigation, though, which is kind of interesting. I think we can board in the Toxic Deluge. I mean, how, how is our mana base looking? Are we going to play all the lands? Do we, have, do we have enough? We're not going to play this.
I guess getting plow under. I don't feel like we're a plow under deck here. Yeah, I like this. Okay. Let's sort by color. Yeah, Spellseer being able to get uh, him to Torok, Inquisition, Abrupt Decay, or um, Pact of Negation seems real good. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven sources of blue. I think that's fine. Nah, eh, we'll probably go to eight because we have a lot of these blues are. Green we have. Does Bloodstain Market a green? I don't think so. Oh, we actually have Watery Grave. I don't think we need Steam Vents, do we? Because Bloodstain Mire is going to get a red or a blue. No, we just want to get Watery Grave or Swamp. Like, we don't need the red. This is going to get blue anyway because we have Watery Grave. Yeah, that makes more sense. One, two, three, four, five, six, probably seven. Three. Bloodstained Mire does not get, we, we've confirmed now. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, probably, probably eight. And then five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That's too much. We'll go down to ten. So this is ten, eight, seven. I think that's good. And we still get one more, which is what I was kind of hoping for. Just make sure we're keeping track correctly. This is six sources, seven sources of blue. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Bloodstain Mire gets this. Seven blue seems fine. Uh, green, we have nine sources of green. Four, five, six. This does not get green. So eight sources of green. We're just going to add another green. Because you want to be able to have uh, Elves of Doom Shadow or Dragon Tree Speaker on turn one. And then black, we should have also nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, we actually have ten sources of black, which is great. Yeah, all right, this seems good. I'll keep this hand. Ophiomancer, Looter, Exclusion Mage. Yeah, we'll just get rid of the Looter. Don't hit the Unbearer Rights. Oh, my God. I mean, they might not have anything. We could have held on to that until they had, like, bigger things. But then they just Venser it. Like, it's kind of... Oof. Well, we're both on we're both on the missing land drops plan. Let's see if there's yep, theirs has changed. Let's see if ours changes. One time. Ours has changed, but not not in any uh meaningful way. <laughs> Pact of negation. <laughs> oh no, we've died. It's funny they didn't play Ophiomancer last turn. They could play Ophiomancer, put two bodies on the board, and then, de then the next turn, if they miss a land drop, they could play... Uh... <sighs> I see. They do need a white source here. It's not a white source. We just Nissa or we harmonize. I feel like harmonize is better for us because it lets us set up for a better next turn. Yeah, 
I can just fence her this too. Well, I'm grateful I did not hit the uh that I that I did hit the the Umbrella rights. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five. We untap two of these, and then we have black No, yeah, that's not gonna do it. Okay, well, this could be good. We also have Liliana. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Next turn we can we can green it up. We don't know any of the cards in their hand though. It's a total mystery. Finally, back have to drive through twenty miles of dead zone to get to work. D deck looks nice though. Well, this will be going up on YouTube, as you know, so. A second blue would be nice for this pack navigation. Maybe we do want one more island in the deck. Cut one swamp for one island. I could see doing that. Hmm. I really don't want a Woodfall Primus here. <laughs> Not yet, anyway. Let's get the second island. Now we have Pact of Negation up, which is nice. Hmm. That's fine. Oh, they're going to get a white, though, aren't they? But I guess we just counter the Umbrella rights when they play it. Or we can just play Woodfall Primus and kill it. That also seems good. Oh, they don't have a white in their deck. They don't have a planes with Umbrella rights, and I guess they have no way to search for it other than Solemn Simulacrum, which they just copied. Yeah, that's fine. Don't stress any bad luck, and no one can complain about you following this tip this go around. So this is a relax. Appreciate it. Awesome. Thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. You are awesome. <laughs> oh, good times. Good times. We could play... Nissa. I don't like Woodfall Primus with like no real benefit on the board. This card is actually quite obnoxious. One, two, three, four, five. We'd have one, two, three. We can untap two, so we'd have four, five. We could downfall. Just keep you untapped. And it just gets a creature off the board. I'm okay with it. I'm tempted to heroes downfall the Ophiomancer. If they play something like Uno, like I mean we're not they're gonna name black, presumably.
Okay, this seems fine then. Sometimes I eat a lot of cookies at once and become an Oreo Mancer. Okay, that's pretty funny. Hey man, if they got mass manips, we got pact of negation, so. Nope, don't like that. Okay, that resolved. That was nice. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine mana, ten mana. Is it worth heroes downfalling the Ophium answer? I don't think so. So we can play this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's do that. I mean, I feel like if they have the counter, they would have countered the pack navigation, right? Like, let your... Okay, wow. Karn just wins the game. Yeah, because I'm like, if you have if you, if you you can let Recurring Nightmare resolve with Ophiomancer on board and Iona in the graveyard, like, you just do that, I think. Yeah, we're going to add one more island and cut one of the swamps. Card ultimate wall on the stack? Weird. <laughs> Okay, that's hilarious. Wow, that's weird that the Karn Ultimate happened while I was on the stack. Must be a bug. I don't hate Toxic Deluge because they seem to have a lot of... Actually, I do like... I like Duress here. I'm just going to submit like that. I don't even care. <laughs> oh, good times. Good times. Oh, dang it. I brought my drink somewhere and then I forgot to bring it back. Ugh. <sighs> Oh my god, Ashiok in hand with two forests. Give me a break. I mean, we could. No. Oh yeah, for sure, for sure. This gets Watery Grave, which is nice. Um, I think we can actually get rid of the forest here. Like, we can go turn one Watery Grave into Duress. Uh, what's the double solid line tattoo mean? Uh, me and my friend Nathan, uh, who actually won a season of Average Joe, the uh, the TV series Average Joe. Uh, he, was the, he was one of the winners on that show. Uh, and he worked with me at Starbucks. And he became one of my better friends. And uh, we just started talking one day at work. And... Um, he was I was like, you know what I've always wanted? I've always just like two two solid black bands on my on my arm. And he was like, "Oh, that's weird because I've always like I, I you know that's weird because I also had the idea of like getting three bands on my arm." And I was like, "Really?" It was very weird. We both coincidentally had like the same design idea. And um he went home and he like drew two bands on one arm and three bands on the other and he's like, "Hey, you know, I think you're right. I think two bands looks better than three bands." And so it was just kind of like a thing. And then he ended up moving to Chicago for like a relationship and a job and all kinds of things. And uh, so the like as a going away present, it was his birthday and like he was moving. Uh, we went downtown and we both got I got I got the uh, the bands on my left arm and he got them on his right arm. So, 
oh, I have to put a card. It's like so seriously waiting for me. And I'm like, I, I hate, for some reason, it's not prompting you to do this. And I don't know. It's kind of obnoxious. By the way, put a card on the bottom. Yeah, I keep forgetting, dude. I keep forgetting. And, um. Oh, that's pretty good. We got Umbera Rights, Liliana of the Veil, Jace the Mind Sculptor, and Collective Brutality. Collective Brutality doesn't hit anything. Jace is terrifying. Oh, God. Oh, God. I think we're just taking the Liliana for now. Wampums. So yeah, now me and my friend Nate both have the, the same tattoo. He has it on his right arm and I have it on my left arm. So this is nice because they're just mulliganing here. Got him. <sighs> I'm about to bust. Put that Jace, leave that Jace in the hand. Uh, we're just going to play Sylvan Library here. For obvious reasons. But then we can go Drown Catacomb, Get Spelt. They go three lands. Yep. Oh, let's see what we get. Pact is not good. What's our play here? We just go, we can go Tree Speaker this thing I wish they didn't have that Jace though we have no answer to Jace unfortunately right now Jace is some serious trouble guys I think we just want the pact and then we're just going to spell seeker Actually, one thing we could have done was play to land, play tree speaker, pump it two. And then we'd have packed mana up. Oh, that would have been good. into the royal we can into the royal and then just like we can't abrupt decay it no wonder i'm getting shrek i'm like well that's only applicable sometimes yeah, I don't know about all that. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, boy. Yeah, I think if we went... I think I think Tree Speaker was the play here. We we actually... Yeah, we could have kept land. We went Tree Speaker. We'd have two... two we could have Mana Confluence. Tree Speaker, Pump Tree Speaker. Pact of Negation. This because you'd be tapped out. Monday Madness? It was Modern Monday, buddy. Everyone gets my stuff wrong. They're like, hey, I used to love when you, you wrote for SCG. I used to love your SCG articles. I used to love your Monday Madness column. I'm like, you guys don't know anything about me. It's like me going up to <laughs> Stanley and being like, oh, man, I used to love your Batman comics. <laughs> You're just like, uh, I didn't do that. I appreciate it, but I didn't do that. Is your average Germany still with that model? No, 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 he is not. Uh, he's his wife's name is Carrie, and they're actually super. They're great people. Um, 
I don't know what to do here. I'm going to keep the land, and I'm probably going to keep... I'll put you on top. I don't feel like this is an aggressive matchup, so I'm okay with this. Also, like, the, the, we would take damage from this anyway, so I might as well just, like... Man, my kingdom for a hissing quagmire. Giggity, giggity is right. Giggity is right. Oh god, Jace the Mind Sculptor is such a busted magic card, guys. I'm really regretting that. The the Draga Tree Speaker play was definitely what we should have done, and I feel bad. I feel bad that I saw the line too late, you know what I mean? Didn't you take Bloodstained Mire over Quagmire? I think I probably did. I think I did. However, Bloodstained Mire got us Watery Grave, so I'm okay with it. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, they didn't play it. This is all very fascinating. Him to Tuchok? Tuchok? Um, I'm going to put you on top. We're going to just go to nine here, boys. This is very fascinating. Why don't we recast a Jace there? Necromancy, Ophiomancer. Oh, are you going to gift Sun Given? Oh, that's a little scary. Well, we definitely want to hit the Necromancy here. All right, so we know you have these four. Come on, Jace and something else, I guess. Nope, that's not gonna work. Okay, we're gonna go black and black. They gifts in response, we packed it, I think. Actually, do we care about that? Because like, That's fine. Actually, if this works, we can just animate dead whatever they get. We can just get an Iona and like name blue or black, which is pretty nuts. I feel like we're in good shape here. What with this uh, this animate dead sitting pretty. Yeah, Monday Madness is the uh, the Jim Cramer stock market show. Oh man, this is a tough choice. I I don't blame them. This is a this is a quite a difficult decision they gotta make here. Plus, they're gonna discard two of these cards. I love that Manic Monday song you put out in the 80s. Yeah. Just another modern Monday. Whoa, whoa. The bad thing is we're going down to eight because of this, this mana confluence, but... That's life, man. That's life. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, fetch shock double sylvan draw. Yep, that'll that's uh that's that's eleven, all right. Four, four, two, and one. I wish it was a chicken Sunday. Whoa, whoa. Okay, so they did the, did the typical uh, draw the uh, the just put two dudes in the graveyard. Okay, so now we know the three cards in their hand. We hit Unburial and Ophiomancer. We're gonna name Blue. <laughs> we could get Gristlebrand, right? But like this prevents them from playing Jace, so we don't actually need the Pact. Good games. Just another... So now they're in top deck mode. They can't cast the Jace, and whatever they draw, we can counter, so... Got him! Our deck is sweet. I'm going to take out one of the Swampies and add one more of these these blue lands. I don't know what they're called. Is 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 Lons? I don't know. It, this game's confusing. And then we're going to run it back. Is land, is land? It's like the meme. You know the meme, the little bird, the butterfly meme. Come on, guys. There is no chicken Sunday emote because I really don't even know how what it would be. I like the disappointment. Is there no chicken Sunday emote? What the hell is wrong with this stream? Well, I never. All right, I'm going to keep this hand. Ideally, they go turn one and tomb, and then we're like, yoink. Okay, they're not going to do that. Oh, Liliana's good here, though. Elves of Deep Shadow one time. Dang it. Dang it. It's not going good, guys. I did not see a King Solknar in chat, but I hope I hope if they were in chat that they're classy enough to close the stream because I don't know what kind of advan I don't know what kind of uh pleasure you would derive from cheating against me in a cube draft. Oh yo, yep, there you go. There you go. I just heard my voice. <laughs> I just heard my voice. You mean your name. I don't think you heard your voice. Yeah, I got you. Feels bad, man. <laughs> Maybe high. <laughs> oh, Lord. Well, biscuits. Butter my biscuits. I really want him to Torok here. <sighs> oh, we're not dead yet. Just another manic Monday. Whoa, whoa.
How many more big green threats could they have? 15? Uh, maybe. I see. I'm going to concede the game based on this this decision you've made, this play decision you've made. What have you done? I cannot believe what you have done. What does that meme? Can you guys fill me in on the what the what the what have you done meme? I don't know what that is, but like can you guys help? I cannot believe that you have done this or something. I can't believe you've done this. Yeah, what? <laughs> oh man, Mike says that a lot and I'm just like, what is that from, man? Oh my god. So basically, um, what I was thinking of was, um, oh fuck, I can't believe you've done this. <laughs> Yeah, that's an appropriate response to getting punched in the face. <laughs> it's like, oh man, I can't believe you've done this. I can't believe you've done this. Wow, dude. That's great. That's solid. I can't believe you've done this. <laughs> so random. Oh boy. Alright, you know what? I'll give it a go. I'll give it a whirl. So we are going to get the old, uh, you know, you know what we're getting. Oh, nice bird. I like your bird. I do like your bird, actually. That's not, that wasn't a hyperbole. That wasn't a, that wasn't being facetious there. It was just... I genuinely do like it. It's a nice bird. I can't believe you've done this. Wow, that was the last card we could have searched for with Bloodstained Mire. Oh, that was a good draw. Thanks for streaming. Found out I'm stuck at work for an extra three hours, so this makes it bearable. Frank and the Barbalaboos, anytime, buddy. Glad to help. Glad to be of service. And if you guys haven't done so, definitely hit those follow and subscribe buttons. Those help me out a ton as a full-time streamer who's here five days a week, sometimes six days a week. I really appreciate the support, and you guys uh, you guys can help me out. Or you can go to MeUndies.com slash Frank Lepore. You'll get 15% off some super comfortable micromodal fabric, underwear, lounge pants, socks, tees, sneakers, do-rags, belts. No, those last three, I was just kidding. Those aren't real things that you can get. I can't believe that you've done this. But MeUndies.com slash Frank Lepore. 15% off free shipping for returns. It's a cool deal. Do rags, don't rags, whatever whatever you want to do. Whatever you want to, whatever, what kind of rag you want. I really don't want to get plow under here. I'm kind of tempted to bounce this bird. I don't love this plan, I'm going to be honest with you, but I am afraid of plow under. <sighs> At least we can go Bloodline Keeper next turn. Yeah, that's fine. All this is fine. One thing I would love would be that uh, that that deluge that I brought in. All right. Well, I'm at the mercy of whatever's happening here. I'll take one. I don't feel like you having like magma jet or something to kill my bloodline keeper. It's 
Something's happening. Green Sun Zenith for five. Walking Ballista for three. All right, so you're just trading straight up, whereas, like, previously it would have been better to keep the Ballista on board, which I can get behind. Deluge. One, two, three, four, five. Untap two. Doesn't do anything here, so we're going to actually... Well, we do have it. The eyes have it, guys. Everybody have fun tonight. Everybody Wang Chung tonight. Uh-oh. I see. I can't believe you have done this. Okay. Well, that's pretty good, because now they can't activate this. Doesn't really matter. We're going to deluge for two. I guess we could have went one, two, three, four, five. No, nah, I don't like that. Wait, one, two. If we played this instead, we played a swamp, right? One, two, three, four, five. No, because then we only have two black, so. Was it a Den Protector? It was a Rattleclaw Mystic. Sounds good. <laughs> eh, Liliana's pretty good here. Yeah, I don't want you paying for this guy next turn, so we're just going to do this. Play a forest. So now Liliana will survive. And next turn we get to kill two more guys. I'm going to FNM instead of Wang Chunging. Well, you can see, but here's the thing: you can probably Wang Chung at FNM. I think. I, I don't really feel like that's. I don't think they're mutually exclusive. And that's how you spread the message of Wang Chung. Oh, good! You have hit an eight thousand mana drop. Eight mana, huh? 8x for 7. Didn't know. That is why you top 8 a pro tour when I have. That's why. Because I knew when to Wang Chung. The answer was tonight. And that's a good one. That is a good one. Solid draw is solid. Yep, that is a good one. We have three lands in our hand. That's quality. My top tech was not as good. I guess we can hope to hit something. I don't know what it is. We're going to one life. So... Thank goodness we didn't play this, huh? Okay. 
There's like this guy is trampled, so there's like nothing we can do here. Even deranged hermit doesn't save us, unfortunately. Yeah, that's pretty much the end. Oh well. Everybody Wang Chung tonight. Also, if you guys are looking for another way to uh, support the channel, you can check out manatraders.com. The link is in my description below, along with the promo code. And Manatraders offers some sweet rental services. You can rent physical paper magic decks. You can rent entire decks for events. Or you can rent uh, magic online cards. You can rent any number of magic online cards up to uh, whatever subscription you choose. And uh, you'll get 20% off your first three-month subscription with the promo codes and the link in my description. 20% off your subscription with the link in my description. That's how it goes. What if I'm looking for a way to sabotage the channel? Well, I don't have any ways for you to do that off the top of my head. But I assume there are groups of evil henchmen uh, that have been plotting that for some time that you could probably coordinate with. And I, I imagine you guys could come up with a pretty decent, uh, pretty decent plot. I'm going to keep this hand. This hand is... G -g -g gasoline <laughs> why does he say it like like John Ralphio from uh, from Parks and Rec I don't know get the name Elk Tears and pick Nicol Bolas in the draft that's actually a great way to do it it's true that's true if you go to the discord there is a sabotage Frank's channel uh, channel there's a channel channel John Ralpho, he's the worst. Wow, that was rude. Let's go get us a thing. We're going to play this on two, this on three. Oh, yeah. We're going to be Wang Chunging tonight, boys. You got it. Take my pack navigation. Everybody Wang Chung tonight puts you on top. I'm going to draw both of these because I want to hit lands here. So We want to maximize that landage. This is just rude. Everything they're doing is so rude right now. It's unbelievable. We got Siege Gang, Never Return, and Bloodline Keeper. Okay. Could have gotten him to Torok as well. I mean, they don't have any lands, though. They can't cast a single card in their hand, so. I like Abrupt Decay because it kills this, and then we can keep up Path path packed pack pack path um i probably just want to put these both on top and we'll cast harmonize could 
also abrupt decay and just count the next thing. But oh, that's nice. Now I don't have to play the mana confluence. Although we could take two, we could play this and play Elves of Deep Shadows to go to five. Is that where we want to be? Probably not. You hate harmonize? I don't know. That's a weird thing to do. Yeah, I think I just want this on board. I don't think I want to go to go to four here. Phenomenal. Harmonize in blue or black is pretty medium. I don't think that's true at all. You have Jace's Jace's Ingenuity is now a premier mana, like a premier card card draw spell, and that costs five in blue. Like, whenever blue has a four four mana spell that just draws them three cards out of nowhere, like I mean, without any downfall, without discarding, like that's that's a that's a deal. That's a legit deal. Oh, of course, Factor Fiction is better and more fun to resolve, but, like, ain't nobody arguing that. Just because one card is better than another doesn't mean the card it's better than is not good. I mean, Ancestral Recall is better than Factor Fiction. Doesn't mean Factor Fiction's bad. I'm trying to figure out our plan here. I really want to get this off the board, and maybe we just keep up... I mean, we're at three right now. It's pretty dangerous. I mean, they're not hitting lands, though, so I guess that's okay. <laughs> sure. I guess we should uh, I guess we should have done it last turn. I don't know. Oh, I guess we could have Heroes Downfall in response and then Pact, but that still seems pretty bad. Yeah, we just got a little too greedy with the cards, I think. That was our fault. I feel like the rest should just be in here instead of into the royal. I think it's just better. Right, like, the, like knowing something better exists in a different color doesn't make me feel bad about the best things we have in this color. Like, I don't know, that's a... Uh, we have no way to get a green. I'm still going to keep this hand. Man, overgrown tomb here. Be pretty good. Well, we're actually going to crack this now because I don't want to, like, have to draw our final land to, to fetch with this big guy, so. I mean, they also top-decked their last two, the last two draws in the game with Magma Jet, 
lightning strike. So, like, they didn't have either of those. Man, whose fault is it that the command didn't work? Pernicious dude. That last island, or last swamp, rather. Green. Pfft. Well, I feel like you misinterpreted me there, Magic Online. I feel like you misinterpreted me there. Hmm. Gotta land this time. But they did nothing with it. Hmm. Yeah, we're just gonna abrupt decay and then probably do whisper next turn. You got it. Aggressive. Oh boy. Oh boy. Well, 6-6 six, six beats a 4-4, th uh, four, four, so that's cool. Hey, Code Jumbo. That's a solid meme. That's a solid meme. Lightning strike, lightning strike. Oh, okay. Well, that's good. That's cool, man. That's pretty cool. If we draw a uh, Toxic Deluge, we can... Him to Torok. What are you doing on both of these cards, but neither of them do anything for you on the next turn? Just bin them both? That seems bad when we have Woodfall Primus in hand. All right, so we're going to play Elves of Deep Shadow, Land, Forest. Oof. Oof. I don't know how we win this game, though. Like, they have one card, but still, I'm afraid of them. Main phase, vampire. Cough. Hmm. Okay. Did you just steal their last card?
That seems lucky. Lucky, 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 lucky. So now we're going to do some surveilling. We want a green source. Uh, I don't care about this guy. I'll put you on top because we just want to hit Woodfall Primey Boy. I feel like the better play was killing your Doom Whisper with that than just flying a cough. So at least you still have. Wait, what? Oh, I see. Killing this and then attacking. Yeah, that actually does seem better because then they get to kill both. I agree with you. I just went to get a drink, but my drink was gone. I went to get a drink, but my drink was gone. I don't care about that. Also, if we draw a Toxic Deluge and we just Deluge for four, we just get to keep everything. All right, they have no cards in hand. Yep. It's the worst thing we could have drawn. I mean, if they hit one removal spell, they kill this guy and they can attack for six in the air. It's pretty bad. Okay. We're, we're, we're really looking for a deluge here. Send me a deluge. Oh. Yeah, we're not, we're not, we don't have the luxury of not surveilling anymore. It's like deluge or bust time because they have a pretty wide board. I mean, I got one more, right? No, because we can't. We have to do... Oh, God, we're actually... I guess we could Deluge for three still and kill everything except for the Thunderbreak Regent, which I think is still fine. Does Liliana do anything? Oh, God. Yeah, I think we're dead this game, but... Like, they have five attackers. We have three blockers, so we can let a one and a two get through. We go to one, if they alpha. Whereas, like, any removal spell or any burn spell, which we know they have a ton of, just kills us. So, I think, our, I think we're on borrowed time here, guys. Yep. That's what we were afraid of. Block big guy. Block you. Block this dude. Go to one. Assume you drew lightning strike. Because you never don't. <laughs> That's never, never not happened. All right. Well, your draws are phenomenal. And ours were less phenomenal. But anyway... Really appreciate the uh, 
the stipulations. Anthor, thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. You are awesome. And uh, if you guys want to have your own stips done, um, get them in soon because we're going to be uh, done with the cube coming next week. I think we're going to be streaming some cube on Monday and on Wednesday and uh, today. And that's pretty much it because Tuesday I will be in the uh, the streamer all access, early access uh, War of the Spark preview event from uh, Wizards of the Coast. So uh, thanks to them for inviting me to that. But uh, yeah. Uh, slam those like and subscribe buttons check me out on patreon on twitch on meundies.com slash frank lapore on mana traders on cool stuff inc check out all the places and i'll see you guys next time thanks for watching